Hello, I'm going to talk to you today about how to identify the difference between vertebrates and invertebrates. And in this picture, it shows two different categories. One side is vertebrates and the other is invertebrates. And how do you tell the difference? Well, I'm going to explain to you what is a vertebrate and what isn't a vertebrate and what is a invertebrate. Invertebrates are animals that do not have a backbone. They have a hard outer shell that protects their organs. There are a lot more invertebrates than vertebrates. About 97% of all animals are invertebrates. Um, some examples of invertebrates is like bacteria, worms, snails, starfish, spiders, insects, or crabs. And this crawdad right here it shows a good example of how it's a invertebrate. See the hard outer shell? That means that it does not have a backbone because the hard outer shell protects all its organs inside. If you have ever touched a crawdad, you can feel how hard it is. Some are very soft, but some, like this one, is really hard and that helps protect them against predators and other things just like that. Well, vertebrates are animals that have a backbone. They have an internal system of bones called the endoskeleton. The vertebrae, skull, and other bones of the exoskeleton, I mean the endoskeleton, sorry, support and protect the animal's internal organs. The skeleton also provides a place where muscles are attached. As you see in this picture with the trout, you don't see no hard outer layer like you did with the crawdad. Here, they need bones to protect their internal organs, such as we do. You cannot see our bones unless you get an x-ray of them. And that is how you tell the difference between the vertebrate and invertebrate. Vertebrates have a backbone and have a bone system called the endoskeleton, which means all the bones and everything are inside the skin and invertebrates they do not have a backbone and they have a hard outer shell to protect all their organs thank you